At this time, please welcome to the podium Tyler Daniel to lead us in the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you. You may now be seated. Good morning again. As the proud principal of Lincoln Park Academy, and on behalf of the administration and faculty, it is my distinct honor to welcome you to the class of 2023 graduation ceremony. Before we get started, I would like to take this opportunity to introduce our distinguished guests uh, here with us today. Mr. Troy Ingersoll, school board chair. Ms. Debbie Hawley, school board vice chair. Dr. Donna Mills, school board member. Ms. Jennifer Richardson, school board member. Dr. Jonathan R. Prince, superintendent of St. Lucie Public Schools. And Dr. Helen Wild, deputy superintendent of St. Lucie Public Schools. It is with great Greyhound pride that I stand before you during this joyful occasion this morning. Today is a day all of us, all of us have waited for with great anticipation. It marks yet another great milestone, not only in the educational careers, but in the lives of the 182 graduating seniors. Although it should have been 183, we did have an unfortunate loss at the start of the year, but he will always be in our hearts and our minds. Yes, I'm talking about the 182 graduating seniors of Lincoln Park Academy's class of 2023. Today, we celebrate 13 years of hard work and dedication, resulting in the culmination of outstanding achievements in academics, athletics, and the arts. Each of you has demonstrated a high level of determination and resiliency during these past years. The past four years have not been easy. They have been challenging. Your freshman year was cut short as you finished out the fourth quarter of the school year online. Your sophomore year was even more challenging as half of your class stayed home for online learning while the other half came to school for in-person learning, having to deal with the disruptions of numerous quarantines caused by COVID-19. But you stayed the course, you persevered, and you did not let that stop you. Graduates, it has been a privilege to see you matriculate from sixth grade, for those of you who started at Lincoln Park Academy, or ninth grade, 10th grade, 11th grade, or even 12th grade this year to your senior year and where you are today. I have watched you grow into confident young men and women seated before us, equipped with the knowledge and skills needed to succeed as lifelong learners and contributors to our diverse society. As I reflect on your years at LPA, many of you have completed the most challenging and rigorous courses LPA has to offer, such as the IB Diploma Program, Advanced Placement, Dual Enrollment, our CAPE Academy, and Project Lead the Way. 15 of you have already earned your associate's degree through dual enrollment. 39 of you are eligible for the IB Diploma. As a class, you earned 147 industry certifications, ensuring your career readiness and marketability for the workforce. One of you has committed to serve our great nation in the armed forces, and I salute you. 10 of you have committed to coming back to St. Lucie County and becoming educators in St. Lucie Public Schools. Finally, 
As a class, you have earned over $5.2 million in scholarships. Congratulations. As you depart Lincoln, dear Lincoln, and spread your knowledge from pole to pole, you will forever carry the rich memories that filled your hearts and minds during your years here. It has been my honor to have shared in your learning during your time at Lincoln Park Academy. Class of 2023, I congratulate you and look forward to hearing and seeing the outstanding things you will do as you embark on your new chapter in life. The Staffoli and I wish you the very best and much success in your future endeavors. Thank you. At this time, I would like to invite the superintendent of St. Lucie Public Schools, Dr. Jonathan R. Prince, to the podium for his comments. Good morning. So uh, I've got some good news and I've got some bad news. The good news is it looks like we're going to avoid rain. The bad news is it's a little hot. <laughs> so we're going we're to move this along. I want to congratulate you graduates. We've got something in common. Lincoln Park Academy is the highest performing high school on the Treasure Coast. And why I say that is we have something in common because St. Lucie County Public Schools for the first time is the highest performing school district on the Treasure Coast. Outperforming Martin and Indian River County, but not that anybody's taking notes, just wanted to let the crowd know that. But anyway, Mr. Santabria mentioned something about the graduates. You know, seniors, think back when you were 14 years old and you're starting ninth grade, okay? You're now young men and women, but at the time, what did you know? And Mr. Santabria mentioned going through what you went through with the global pandemic the last nine weeks of your freshman year in high school, and then 10th grade having to go completely virtual and the challenges that, that you had. Let's think about it. When have we had a time in our history that we couldn't go out and buy uh, tissue paper? Think about going into Publix, you can't find things. It was a crazy time and you persevered. Actually, you came out on the other side even stronger. And I commend you for that because one thing you're gonna need in this life is resilience. Each and every one of you sitting in those chairs you will fail. You will. Once or twice, maybe more. But the bottom line is, is the measure of who you are is how you handle that. How you handle that and what you learn from it. And whether you can learn from your mistakes and carry that forward and persevere, because I believe that you can. With that being said, graduates, I want to wish you the best of luck. Today should be one of the most special days of your life 30 years from now, you're going to look back at this time and wish you had some of it back. I can tell you that from experience. But I do want you to know, take a moment and remember this. Sometimes all of our memories are through our, our cell phones and through social media. Really make a point to remember today. Remember the events of today because you will look back fondly on those memories. So I'll leave you with a quote. It's one of my favorite quotes of Dr. Seuss. And it, I say it at all of our graduations, is don't cry because it's over, smile because it happened. Graduates, congratulations, and good luck in your future. Thank you. Thank you, Dr. Prince. At this time, it is my honor to introduce to you the president and salutatorian for the class of 2023. She has been enrolled at Lincoln Park Academy since ninth grade and has a weighted grade point average of 6.39. Please welcome to the podium your class president and salutatorian for the Lincoln Park Academy class of 2023, Tyler Daniel. Thank you, Mr. Santabria, for the introduction. On behalf of my fellow graduates, I would like to welcome all esteemed faculty, friends, staff, and distinguished guests 
to the Lincoln Park Academy Class of 2023 commencement ceremony. Thank you to our counselors, our deans, our superintendent, Dr. Prince, the LPA administrative team, Mr. Sanabria, Ms. Stone, Ms. Octavie, and Mr. Poole, and all the dignitaries here today. As senior class president, I'm honored to speak to you on this momentous occasion. Now it's time to say congratulations. We worked so hard, some of us forgot how to vacation, but we had the dedication, and we made it. Yeah, we made it. Let's consider how far we've come individually and as a class. Only four years ago, we were timid freshmen from, and we transitioned from middle to high school. We found ourselves learning how to navigate our new environment. And as we were just about to get the hang of it, we got an extended spring break. One day became two days and, and then it became a lot of days and we realized this was gonna be a long spring break. Despite this, we've grown mentally and physically, achieved our goals, formed friendships, and gained skills and knowledge to serve us well into our future endeavors. Just think about all the new vocabulary we now know. Riz, mid, slay. In my opinion, I think that's a W. As we embark on this new phase of our lives, let us acknowledge those who have helped us get to where we are today and remember those who are not here to celebrate with us, especially our classmate and friend, Daniel Portillo. Today is actually his 18th birthday, so I want you guys to keep that in your hearts. As influential Canadian philosopher, Sir Drake Graham II said, sometimes it's the journey that teaches you a lot about your destination. Let us embrace the challenges that await us, rise to the occasion, and continue striving for excellence in all that we do. So now as the salutatorian of the class of 2023, I want to express my appreciation for all our middle and high school teachers. Although I did not have the opportunity to be a student in all of your classrooms, I had the chance to build relationships with many of you. And for that, I'm thankful. I would especially like to thank our fantastic behind the scenes staff team, who are a main component to the backbone of our school. And thank you to the former teachers, mentors, coaches, teams, and organizations that supported me from elementary to high school. At LPA, I have been blessed to be a part of wonderful communities, including Troop 6958 and the IB program. Last, but certainly not least, thank you to my family for being an instrumental reason for why I am here today. Specifically, I want to express my gratitude for my parents, Pierre and Sylvia Daniel. You can clap to them, they're over there. <laughs> Who instilled in me a strong passion for learning and taught me the values of hard work, kindness, and determination. The accomplishments I have made would not have been possible without you. Thank you to my sister, Sydney Daniel, and my adopted four-legged sister, Marley Daniel, our cat. Sydney, you are the best sister and friend I could ask for. Although there's a four-year age gap between us, you motivate and inspire me to be the best version of myself. Congratulations to you all. You passed the test. You showed patience. Patience is the ability to, and capacity to accept tolerance or delay or long graduation speeches uh, without getting angry or upset. Patience is preparing yourself for the long haul. Whatever path you choose in life, there are gonna be setbacks along the way. You will encounter ignorant people and not so great coworkers. You will find yourself frustrated. You won't always get everything you want, at least not in the time that you hoped for it. So embrace discomfort, welcome perseverance, don't say goodbye to your aspirations. Stick with it and be persistent. Don't use patience as an excuse to lose hope if you hit a roadblock. Don't give up in the face of failure or Debbie Downers. So if you have an idea for a book, write it. If you have a vision for a song, sing it. If you have a concept for an invention, share it. Don't be afraid to take that first step. Remember that every step you take does not have to be perfect or great, but just better than the last one you took. That's how progress is made and worlds are changed. 
Thank you faculty, friends, family, school board members, and Dr. Prince for being here today. And thank you, class of 2023. Go Greyhounds. Thank you, Tyler. Before you depart and leave the stage, it is my pleasure to present you with the Salutatorian Award. Congratulations again. At this time, it is my pleasure and honor to introduce the valedictorian for the class of 2023. She has been enrolled at Lincoln Park Academy since sixth grade. She has a weighted grade point average of 6.40. Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you your valedictorian for Lincoln Park Academy's class of 2023 Anna Rose Hillhorse. Thank you, Principal Santa Bria. Good morning, faculty, staff, parents, and fellow graduates, and a warm welcome to Superintendent Prince, board members, and community officials for their presence here today. I would like to start by expressing my gratitude to everyone who has supported and guided us throughout our journey. To our teachers, staff, and administration, thank you for making it possible for us to finally walk across this stage today and into the next chapter of our lives. To our parents and families, thank you for the unwavering support, love, and encouragement that, which have been instrumental in getting us here to this momentous day. I am incredibly blessed to be in this position, and I thank the Lord for the privilege to be able to stand here before you today. Reflecting on my experiences in high school, I realized that it has been a time of growth, challenges, and opportunities. I've learned that setbacks and failures are not the end, but rather an opportunity to learn and grow. It was not easy balancing IB, AP, and dual enrollment with sports, clubs, and volunteering, but it has taught me the importance of time management, prioritization, and resilience. Throughout our high school years, there were tough times and even tougher times. In the end, we have all grown and transformed into a new and improved version of ourselves, ready to step out into the world and form the best memories we've yet to experience. I'll be forever grateful for the friendships and connections I've made with my class Mates, being able to go out into the world with a community of intelligent and innovative thinkers alongside me. To my fellow graduates, as we stand here today, we've accomplished a significant milestone in our lives. However, we should not rest on our laurels. The world is vast and the opportunities are endless, but it takes determination, hard work, and perseverance to achieve success. We should be proud of what we've accomplished, but also keep pushing ourselves to do better and to be better. In the words of Walt Disney, if you can dream it, you can do it. Let us all vehemently strive after our unique creativity and dreams in honor of one who tragically did not get the opportunity to stand with us today. Over my time here at LPA, I am grateful for the opportunities I was able to create for myself, to have been able to travel and place at state events, to collaborate on research for Opportunity Insights, and ultimately to be able to work with the Microsoft Corporation. Though there were many things left yet unaccomplished, we can look back upon our time and appreciate the strength we had to advocate for ourselves and let us use that strength to fuel, as fuel to pursue even greater accomplishments in the future. I'd like to offer some words of advice to my fellow graduates. First, always be curious and open-minded. Second, always be true to yourself and your values. Never compromise your passion or integrity for anyone or anything. Lastly, always give back to the community. It's not just about achieving success, it's about making a positive impact on our world and the people around us. In conclusion, let us move forward with purpose and determination. Let us lose our education, talents, and skills to create a better future for ourselves and for generations to come. Congratulations, Lincoln Park Academy Class of 2023. Thank you, Anna Rose. Before you depart and leave the stage, it is my pleasure to present you with the Valedictorian Award. Congratulations. Congratulations again. 
Dr. Prince, will you please join me at the podium? Distinguished members of the school board and Superintendent Prince, as principal of Lincoln Park Academy, I present to you the graduating class of 2023. I certify that they have met the graduation requirements of the school board of St. Lucie County and the state of Florida. Mr. Santabria, you may call the class rolls. All right. Okay. Okay. No, no, Thank you, Dr. Prince. Will the candidates on the first row please rise and proceed to the stage? I just figured the first one, second one, first one, second one, first one. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Oh, God. No, they, they chicken. Anna Rose Hillhorst. The card? Where are your cards? New cards. Tyler Daniel. Madison Nisha, Nisha Adkins. Catherine Pinto. Roseanne Rodriguez. Great honors, IB diploma candidate. Angelina Naomi Gonzalez. Great honors, IB diploma candidate. Luke Ratoodle. Great honors, IB diploma candidate. Shelly Orlon, great honors, IB diploma candidate. Nadia Rochelle Barco, great honors, IB diploma candidate. Olivier Yori Lubin, great honors, IB diploma candidate. Ethan Isaac Toombs, great honors, IB diploma candidate. Gabriella Barnaby, great honors, IB diploma candidate. <laughs> Kyle Feveris, great honors. Jordan Anthony Bruce Hall, great honors, IB diploma candidate. Jacob Andriaco, great honors, IB diploma candidate. Sarah Cheney, great honors, IB diploma candidate. Kate Margaret Miklas, great honors, IB diploma candidate. Mia Michaela hey Morrison, great honors, AA degree. Bobby Lee, great honors, IB diploma candidate. Zamil Ali Abid, great honors, IB diploma candidate. Courtney Adashi, great honors. Kayla S. Alexis, great honors. Kaylee Marie Alfred, great honors. Josue Andrade. <laughs> Santos Germina, Germano Andrade. Anaya Arma, honors. Aaron Ash. Megan Ash, great honors. Devin Avellaneda, great honors. Steven Elijah Bailey, honors. Mireya Bankston. Alexia Barron, honors. Denise Bautista, great honors. Kirby Basalius, great honors. Rachel Becker, great honors. Angelica Maria Belmontes, great honors. Mercedes Benjamin Anderson, honors. Claire Elizabeth Betts, great honors. Jillian Bogatz, great honors. Casey Lynn Bourne, great honors. Russell Bourne, great honors. Myra Bracero, great honors, AA degree. Jolie Brown, great honors. Kieran Sebastian Brown, great honors. Princess Sierra Brown, Sumira Marie Brown, great honors. Santeria Brown, with honors. Tiana Olivia Bruce, honors. Cora Katie, honors. Sterling Nicole Carr, great honors. Nathaniel Castor, honors. Farzine Faraz Ali Chagani, great honors. Derricka Cheney, great honors. Kiera Janai Chapman Martinez, great honors. Jennings Charles, honors. Jasmine Aline Coughlin, great honors. Brooke Clanton, great honors. Brandy Cornett. Christian Conrad, great honors, IB diploma candidate. Sonoya T. De Selva, great honors, IB diploma. Haley Daniels, great honors. Joshua Thomas Demko, great honors, IB diploma. Madison Davis, great honors. Nicholas Dracolic, 
Great honors. Noah DiBernardo, great honors. Jacqueline Dyer, great honors. A Miracle Duval. Michael Edwin Eshelman, great honors. Shabania Erbilis, great honors. Diego Esparza Rodriguez, great honors. Ansel Espinal, great honors. Jonas Mikael Eugene, great honors. Candilo Esquivel, great honors. Star Fleet. Aaron Fitzgerald, great honors. AA degree. Julia Fowler, honors. Justoni Latifa Freeman, honors. Dakota Jade Frederick, great honors. Nicholas Gallo, honors. Amy Garcia, great honors. Michael Garcia, great honors. Haley Garrison, great honors. Taylor Marie Gates, honors. Sadie Marie Brooklyn Gillette. Francisco Godinez, great honors. Ariana Gokachea, great honors. IB Diploma. Bridget Green, great honors. Curtis Green III. Kyle Gray, great honors. Daniela Concepcion Godino Rios, great honors. IB Diploma. Tyrell Higgins, great honors. Kayana Lynn Guerrero, honors. Tegan Hendricks, honors. Garrett Scott Holly, great honors. Jimena Hernandez, honors. Luke Hessler, great honors, AA degree. Jade Howard, great honors. Wesley Ryan Hogston, great honors. Ian Hunter, great honors, IB diploma candidate. DeCarry Jumel Hubbard, honors. Andreas Ingram. Caden Grant Hutchison, honors. Muhammad Ibrahim, honors. Islandi Isaac, great honors. Alicia Jackson, great honors, AA degree. Ryan James Inegro, great honors, IB diploma. Brandon Jerger, honors. Juvelt Jean, great honors, IB diploma. Justice Jones, great honors, AA degree. Elizabeth Claudia Jones, great honors. Isabel Gray. Reagan. Honors. Ma Reagan May Jones, great honors, IB Diploma. Walkie Julian. Desiree LaShawn Knight, honors. Callan Kleckner, great honors. Carrie Kwok, great honors, AA degree. Malachi Krasinski, honors. Michaela Leroy, great honors, AA degree. Louisa Laguerre, honors. Jalen C. Lestage, great honors. Levinsky Luador, honors. Jaden Frank Legonde, honors. Noble Divine Lovelace. Wensley Lewis, honors. Jimena Annelise Macias. Anasia Katora Charlin Lundy. Brandy Martinez, honors. Ariel Alexandria Major, great honors. Landon David Maxwell, great honors. Abigail Alondra Mateo Mejia, honors. Emily Miklas, honors. Nairobi Raquel McGriff, great honors. Christian Million. Chandler Miller, great honors, IB Diploma. Eduardo Miranda, great honors, IB Diploma. Roscoe Menace, great honors, AA degree. Abigail Mugley, great honors, AA degree. Rayleigh Moore, great honors, IB Diploma. Nathan Wynn, great honors. Marquis Nibs, great honors. Carly Nielsen, great honors, IB Diploma. Sophia Elise Murphy, great honors, IB Diploma. Sophia Pacero, great honors, IB Diploma. Yaritza Nava Esquivel, great honors. Jalen Parrish. Diego Angelo Otero, great honors. Aria Patel, great honors, IB Diploma. Aisha Denise Prince, honors. Michael Napier, honors. Michelle Andrea Renteria, great honors. Anna Robinson, great honors, IB Diploma. Christopher Charles Robertson, great honors, IB Diploma. Ryan Rodriguez, great honors, IB Diploma. Dylan Jared Rocky, great honors. Vanessa Rodriguez, great honors. Leandi Michelle Rodriguez Gonzalez, great honors. Artemio Rubio, great honors. 
Liana Rossashan Nader, great honors, IB diploma. Hannah Smith, honors. Andres Rene Serrano. Bianca Rebecca Soto, great honors, IB diploma. Catherine Elise Soban, great honors. Casey Vivian Stolzer, great honors, AA degree. Quinn Walker Stevenson, great honors. Alexandria Louise Taylor, great honors. Kinesia Armani Sweet, great honors. Valerie Truby, great honors. Riley Ann Tiger, great honors. Angelia Rinker, great honors, AA degree. Joseph Topnick, great honors. Jacob Warren, great honors. Caitlin Ward, honors. Isaiah Gilbert, William, great honors, AA degree. Ciara Webb, great honors. Sydney Blake Wilson, great honors. Christina Nicole Wilson, great honors. Lorraine Divine Grace Zimmerman, great honors. Chloe Milan Wright, great honors. Dr. Prince, will you please join me again at the podium? Will all the graduates please rise? <laughs> Dr. Prince, as principal of Lincoln Park Academy, I present the graduating class of 2023. Graduates of St. Lucie Public Schools, they await your confirmation. Students, by the authority vested in me as a superintendent of St. Lucie County Public Schools, I now confirm you as graduates. You may turn your tassels. Seniors, please remain standing for the playing of our alma mater.
Dr. Prince and distinguished guests on, on stage, and to all of our parents, families, and friends. Thank you for joining us as we celebrate the Lincoln Park Academy class of 2023. As we begin our recessional, I ask the audience to remain seated until the last graduate exits the stadium. We may begin our recessional. Thank you. 